Hi, this is Sergey from Parallels. In this video, I'll show you how Parallels Remote Application Server works with multi-factor authentication providers. In my lab environment, I've configured Duo as a MFA provider, and this is what happens when I'm trying to log in using Parallels client. On this page, uh, I'm requested to insert the one-time password that I can take uh, from a mobile application. So let's insert it and click OK. And here, as you can see, uh, I can see the list of uh, published resources available for the, my test account. So this means that I successfully uh, test the Duo authentication and now can launch any published resource and start working on that. To configure MFA to work with Parallels RAS, uh, we need to complete the prerequisites uh, specified by vendor. So in case of Duo, we need to install Duo security authentication proxy component and modify its config file. But before that, in Parallels RAS console, we need to go to the connection MFA uh, tab and here at the provider settings, we need to specify the required provider we are going to work with. I just wanted also to uh, highlight the fact that uh, even though if there is no uh, specific vendor in this list, uh, you may choose just the generic radius provider and uh, use it with any radius capable solution. So in my example, I'm using Duo and here are the settings I need to configure. At the primary server, I need to uh, specify the host name of the uh, machine where I have the Duo authentication proxy installed. Optionally, I can specify the secondary server, uh, so this way I can uh, configure high availability mode, but in my uh, demo environment I'm just using the single machine. And here I need to specify the secret key that I'm going to use uh, in the do a config file as well. So now we can, we can go to the uh, do a configuration file and modify it. Do a supports various types of configuration. So now on the screen you can see the configuration for radio server do only client. Uh, typically you need to gather the integration key, secret key, API host link from Duo portal. Uh, in Radius IP string, you need to specify the uh, IP address of REST publishing agent where we are configuring the uh, MFA provider. Radius secret, the one that we specified in REST console, and the rest uh, are the defaults from uh, Duo. After modifying the config file, we need to restart Duo security authentication proxy service for the changes to take effect. After that, let's return to REST console and ensure that our configuration configured successfully. By clicking on check connection button, we can verify it. Okay, so the basic configuration is done. Optionally, uh, you may configure attributes or automation. In addition to that, you may configure uh, MFA inclusions or exclusions if required and start using your MFA solution with Parallels RAS. Thank you for watching and have a great day. Bye.